Hello and welcome back to another tutorial video on my channel, Wizard Bricks. Um, what I'd like to show you is just how to make a basic brick head in Studio, which is the designer program that I use. And it's you get it via brick link, and on this bit here, just click this extension. Wait for the internet to load. And then this is the page where you can download it. I'll show you a couple of the things on here, but then you've got download, just click that one. And then it comes up with this page and it gives you like an introduction of what you can do in the system. And if you go ahead and click download, I'm going to just, and it comes up down here and then click it open. I'll just cancel it because I've already got it installed. But it's just very simple to get this installed. And then this is what you get when you open it. I've only got Ninja Turtle things here because I've just been doing some new images for those. But if you want to click new, and it comes up with this grid and then what I will show you to do is what I did when I built my first ever brick head was I went on to Google and I just googled the go brick me um, Lego set for instructions which will be found on the Lego website and what you have is you have them down here click on the image wait for it to load Internet's going a bit slow okay so now you've got a PDF of these instructions and it shows you in this book how to make a very basic brick head which is what I'm going to show you how to make in the system and just build it step by step as you see here and then we go back into the program. So then you've got this grid here, which you can build on top of, and all the pieces are categorized over here on the left. So you can see like animal pieces and bricks, boats and brackets. So you've got bricks here. So these are like the standard bricks. And then under, in that subcategory, we've got like modified bricks. So you've got snot bricks, so your stud's not on top. Um, in All in this section, and profile bricks and all that sort of thing so what we're going to do is we are going to look for a few more there's quite a few different categories and then you've got plates which are very helpful when building brick heads I find so what we're going to do is we're just going to build a brick head so you just left click on the piece and drag it into the space and then you've got bricks here as well so you've got that one there and then you right click to delete it after you've put that one in and you just put it there and you can move around by holding the right button down you can zoom in using the scroller and I usually keep this selection on which is the collision one so you can put a brick wherever you want if it's off and there we go you've got it sort of inside another piece and then it highlights like this when it's connected into something that shouldn't be there so I just keep it on just to keep myself safe and make sure everything connects properly and you can also use the directional buttons on the keyboard just to move the piece around as such and then we do that you can also copy and paste pieces by using the normal extension but what we'll do is we'll get into the build and I'll see you on the other side. Also I'd like to mention how you change colours so you've got the colours up here on the right and these are all selected and you've got a tick box on the bottom which is an available colour so if you have it unticked you can have it in any colour you like if you give it a tick like so it shows the colours that actually exist so what we're going to do is make these two pieces just control and click which ones you want and then it comes up with these colours here 
and then I'm going to put it in light bluish grey. And there we go, that's that colour changed. And then back on to building some more of this brick heads. So that's near enough finished and what you can do is on the left right here you can see you can click those pieces and then select them up and you can put all those pieces in a different colour. Then what I do is I just save this one and then we're done. So that is your very basic brick head built into the system and what I do from this point onwards. Give me a little spin. So what I do from this point onwards is I just sort of take pieces away, add them on, um, and then try and create different techniques and different angles. But yeah, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.